focus on the game. That's what we're there for. Make sure you keep to within the time limit because otherwise you're gonna miss something out. Make sure you're prepared. The worst thing is rocking up to one of these presentations and then stumbling over your words and forgetting what you're talking about. It's easy to do, but as long as you manage to stay on message and communicate all the best aspects of your game in as short a space of time as possible, 60 seconds, bam, that is the way to get our attention. And if you're excited about it, then we'll be excited about it. I think it's important for a game to have a unique hook that we can grab onto. Give us something we can actually play. Some developers are trying to show you that just give us iPads and phones and we, we can do it, we're paid for this. You might have a really interesting backstory about, you know, about your, the history of your studio, the history of your game. In three minutes, it doesn't really matter. Don't argue amongst yourselves. You've seen people come up in pairs and then get into massive arguments over specific technicalities of a game. Don't be nervous. We're all just nerds being paid to write about your game. We're, as, uh, we're probably as nervous as you guys are. The Big Indie Pitch gives you a chance to take your game and show it to a bunch of people who know what they're talking about. You can literally get your game on the pages of Pocket Gamer. We use the Big Indie Pitch to find new stuff to write about. It's a fantastic opportunity to walk into a room full of not only members of the press, but also other publishers, other developers. It's a way to mix and mingle with the people that you want to connect with. If you can come and convince us and show us something we're excited by, then we are going to write about it. That's, that's why we're there and that's why you're there too.